Nemesis, Valera. Watch your back. Your soul shall be mine. Okay, we're up against Rogue. Rogue means we need early pressure. Could be done by a knife juggler. Um, I could throw something back to get an Undertaker start or a fly memp just to he kept two cards. Probably means he has a backstab. If I count out Knife Juggler for a backstab, that's pretty rough. Um, but I can follow it up with another one. I'm on the coin, so he doesn't have coin SA7. And can put up this against fans and stuff. That eh, should be okay. My fear is I replace some good minions. Okay, it's not. Okay. It's a mech. Um, I thought it was Miracle, probably because I played so much Miracle the last... Like, if I played Rogue, then Miracle, but... Um, oh, whatever. It's still a good opening. Uh, this is, well, annoying, I guess. <laughs> um, then I set up this. I can kill the Annoyed for next turn, and I can also kill this with the Alpha. I have two pretty good token things and could also set up for a knife juggler. Um, so the way to go is I uh, just have three attack on this here. That's shame. So I could abuse of this, but it doesn't trigger it. And then I can't kill, I cannot kill the Tinker Town Technician. I have to accept that as a fact. <laughs> well, I could play Knife Juggler, hit, hope for a good knife. Well, basically, huh. This might be better than hit it here. I yeah, I should clear the mess a little bit up. Now, well, let's see how this turns out. Um. Yeah, I'll need a knife on this one for sure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I have two more knife. No, one more knife because. This oh, okay. Ah, uh, one knife on this would have been good now, but whatever. Worked out pretty fine still, because now I threaten this one. Um, the he cannot fan or something because of my egg. And I have the alpha to set up for the tokens. Well, he could fan, of course. Takes four attack away and get... Well, we'll see what he does. Hmm. If this board stays around or powers of it, then I can alpha for this for the Tinker Town and probably kill whatever a shredder or something that he plays next turn. And also throw a lot more knives. But the knife chugglers will probably die, I suppose. So many options. Was a little bit unfortunate not to hit the Annoyatron with one knife. But I wanted to have a chance to clear the Tinker Town Technician at least. Hmm. Interesting. This guy's toes. Hmm, okay. So I could play Knife Juggler, Alpha, hit this for three. Um, maybe I get two knives on this. Could happen. And next turn, Dark Iron Dog or something. <laughs> Depends a little bit on what I hit. Oh, we'll see. Okay. 
So the plan is here, I guess. Then there, yeah, okay. That's good. Next turn, maybe Dark Eindorf on something if I need it. This gives me at least a good board. Backstep. Yep. Hmm. Can trade one for one. Um, Dark Eye and White Walker is better for mana. Just playing the Harvest Golem is too weak. Um, just playing the Void Walker and going face. Uh, well, I don't threaten lethal at all, so it doesn't really matter. Let's see what spare part we get. Okay. Ah, oh, that's actu actually interesting. We could, like, save this for the next turn and then Dark Iron Dwarf reversing switch something beneath this. Like, make this a 2-3, a 3-3, three, three, a 3-4-3. Three, three. Huh. It's actually interesting. Could also pump up my, my ward walker a little bit. I don't know. No, just let... Let's, okay. let's just set up for the strongest board that I can come up with. Um, if this stays around... If the if the alpha stays around, I can do it next turn and have a four, five five here or something. Hey pal, Trey Prince here. Huh. Not sure if this is good for him. Uh, I won't use the reverse switch though. I think I could just go face now. Just your opponent, that's mean. Would like to have these things too. Mm. Bring out your dead. Like a Cho or something. <laughs> Golden Trade Prince Gallowix. Nice. Haven't seen it in action so far. Pretty much depends on his ability and board clear. So many options. Hmm. I could have also switched this and just hit it. Now that I think about it, I would have given him the switch, but would have gotten a coin. Huh. Maybe I should have done it. Okay. Three, five, ten, twelve. Twelve is pretty good. Visserad? Ah, okay. Ah, that's why. I see. Oh wow, if you wouldn't have had this eviscerate, would have been lethal, right? 6, 8, 10. Kind of 12. 13. Okay, let's see what we get. Implosion. Do I want to give him an ex implosion? Probably not. Oh, this guy is annoying. I'm facing 14 damage. Um, I'm at 7, but he only has 2 cards. Could use the reversing switch. <laughs> After attacking. Make a very resilient harvest dollar. Oh, I 
missing three damage right now. They want to give him the switch. Well, what the So he has to clear or to kill me this turn. Okay, he can't kill me this turn. So the hope is that he doesn't have AoE, I guess. Hmm. Uh, Flurry? Flurry. Ah, shit. I have to hope for a Doom Guard. Wow, one, one of. <sighs> well, I'll probably play the implosion. Uh, this is twelve. Uh, let's see, okay. Never mind. This was interesting. I haven't seen such a deck before. Actually, I haven't seen Trade, w Trade Prince Gallowix before in my games. Ah, Hunter again. Let's the hunt begin. Your soul shall be mine. Ah, going first. Actually, this could be really useful. I could want to keep a three drop to it. We'll look at everything. I mean, this can deal with uh, web spinners, leper gnomes, clockwork gnomes. These two together can even deal with mad scientists. Okay, let's just keep the whole hand. It's pretty good too, if he doesn't have a turn one. But he has the coin, he probably has a coin. Turn one. Could also develop the creeper, probably better. Especially with alpha and juggler in hand. Animal companion? To my side. Okay. I think I'll just play the Harvest Golem and just hope that he doesn't have Unleash. If I play the Alpha, I can trade both in, but that's a little excessive. I can play Alpha Juggler next I turn, wonder. which will throw a lot of knives. Should be the best option. It's also better against Unleash. Because I would have had two one ones and two two on the board. It's better for mana, better against Unleash. Not as good against Bow, but still good. I'll just take the risk. Okay, it's not a risk anymore. Explosive trap is a problem. And unleash to some extent. That's not as bad. Especially with an abusive sergeant. And uh, that's four. 
probably want to tap for the next turns. I'll use this and this and one knife will probably hit this, otherwise I trade just these two in. Uh, no, this and this, of course. Ah, implosion. Could have needed this before, but still, it's not a problem. Um, here... Um, there, probably. Seems good for me so far. Bring out your dead. So I have five, six, seven, nine. Need five more damage. Doomguard would do it. White Walker, not really. Um. Let's see, if I want to throw some knives, I'll need to sacrifice a lot of stuff here. It's probably the best option. Okay, so. This away, taking this away. Make space for implosion. Boom. Uh, just two damage again. Well, I don't, probably don't die to unleash. Um, seven plus kill command would be twelve. Well Whoops! This goes fast. It's time. I think we're on a 100% win rate, right? Gul'dan versus Rexa. Ah, it's the same one again. I didn't really see what deck, what kind of deck he played, so <sighs> I'll need s this turn one, this turn two. Need an abusive sergeant or something. It's not as resilient as the other board was. And he kept one card. Okay. So it's White Walker against this. I don't know what traps he plays. I don't know if he runs like um, how's it called? Yeah, this one should give me the best options. Uh, wolf riders and stuff. Um, I think I kind of want to clear it. So. On the other hand, you can just hit this once. I hit this once, hit... okay. Yeah, ooze should be best here. Next turn, these two after this like, implosion. Only fear is animal companion Misha for this particular turn. Thinks about hero powering, which is good for me. Yep. Very slow. Another ooze, probably not. There's too much on the board. Um, I can do um, hit, hit. Even get value here. Don't have to. Okay, let's just do it this way. Uh, this will spawn more tokens. So here. <laughs>
This is super weak against Unleash. But I need the free space for the implosion anyways. Mind if I roll need? Hmm. Can't play it though. Um Yeah, what? need more cards. Uh I can just trade these away. Buy this one. Here. I have a lot of attack buffing next turn. <laughs> Haven't seen the sea giant in the last couple of games. Bring out your dead. <laughs> Finally found his Undertaker. Oh, just face? Hmm. Could mean that he has... Um, Kill commands or maybe another, maybe even a trap, I don't know. Uh, that's five, six, seven, eight, ten. Ten is not enough. Play this first. Then I run this into that, but it doesn't die. Means could flood my board again. I should probably develop these two. Which means Get in there fight, like this, this, and this. So this got rid of the web spinner because of kill commands. It's five damage showing, so. The beast on the board plus double kill command would kill me. Uh, I can't think of a combination of cards that kill me now in this particular turn. Mm. Explosive trap would be a problem though, especially because of the bow charge. I'm not sure if he even runs traps. <laughs> That's six, eight, okay. Four, six, seven, eight, thirteen. Huh. If I, if I draw abuse of turn or power warming, I win. Otherwise, it will be tough, I guess. Okay. Well, kill command kills me. Hmm. I think I want to clear it. And I want to keep my guys alive. And I want to taunt up two guys. And I don't want to tap. 4, 6, 7, 8, 13. Ah, oh, that's so close. One of these cards is a web spinner card. Um, I died to shoot kill command is 5. So I died to a beast below 2, man uh, two or 1 mana. Beast plus kill command. Okay, so I have to take the risk, I guess. Uh, I have four attacks for four guys, which is good. So if he has a second unleash, I die, and if he has a beast that is one or two mana and a kill command, then I die. He might have gotten the beast from. His web spin a card, so I don't know. I wonder. <laughs> Seems like he doesn't have lethal at least. Which means I have six, eight, ten, eleven, sixteen this time. Mm. 
means I should have won. A second implosion. Right? 3, 5, 7, 11, 16. Oh, was a fast final push. 